I went through high school as, as one of the first in our entire family, and I got an opportunity to take a vocational education in furniture retail over there. But in February of 1983, I went on a train from Wannerslo, northern part of Denmark, down to uh, Brussels, Belgium, got on a Transworld airplane to Minneapolis, and from there to Dallas got to El Paso, Texas and saw the lights of the city and it was a you know, wonderful sight and you know, looked out and could see the shacks and waris and other things from the, from the window and it's like, what did I do? <laughs> when I was 13, I went to work in a restaurant. By the time I was 20, I had moved to Portland, Oregon and there was these great little hot dog carts, stainless steel, cute little umbrellas over them. I just loved the idea. So I ordered a hot dog cart from New York City, worked my way back to El Paso, and I opened up a hot dog cart all of my own. I got an apartment down there, and you know, I liked to be at the pool, and Barbara and her, her friends showed up down there. We weren't there but 10 or 15 minutes, and here comes four guys speaking this funny language. Before long, we all got to talking, and that evening we all ended up going out to dinner together, and a year later, Soren and I were married. The opportunities in El Paso were just not there for what we wanted to do for the rest of our lives. We heard about an opportunity here in Albuquerque, what was called Team of Copenhagen then. The owner here had wanted to retire, and so it was a perfect opportunity for us to fulfill our dreams of being the owners. You know, we, we feel that we're living our dream to a certain degree right now. Tema is uh, doing extremely well. The, we have a tremendous following in town. And that, those are all the things that I have wanted Tema to become. And right now, I want to continue to bring new fun things to the customers in Albuquerque. We want people to walk into our store and realize this is a different type of furniture. We want people to feel the comfort, to feel the style to be able to realize their design dreams, their dreams for their home, to be a place where they can relax. We have been asked many times, do we want to expand? And it's not our, our vision. We want this to be a strong local player. We put everything back into the, into the business, take good care of our employees, because that's our family. You know, it's, it's our family here, you know, and, and we have, people have been with us for, you know, over 20 years. It truly, you know, our enjoyment comes from seeing our customers uh, getting something that they love into the home, something that they can feel happy about, something that they can trust will be around for a period of time. And also, when it comes down to it, that's what our accomplishment is. It's when we get our product into somebody's home and they absolutely love what they have and are proud of it. That's what Tima means. Because without that, we wouldn't be here. Without the customers coming in and buying from us, this wouldn't exist. We owe everything that we have, you know, everything team has become to our customers. What we want to do is make people's dreams come alive for what they want their home to be.